time for today's big game breakdown. Let's talk a little NFL for Saturday. This is the early game tomorrow. The Broncos and the Chiefs, 4.30 Eastern time, 1.30 here uh, on the left coast in NFL action for Sunday. Right now, looking at the way to talk live on screen, uh, I'm seeing Kansas City minus 11, minus 11 and a half. It's more minus 11s right now. A total of 45 for this one. I'm not a guy that says they're going to kill him very often. That's not the thought process that goes through my mind. And yet, this game sure looks to me like the Chiefs are going to kill him. The Broncos' offense has not worked in any recent meeting against Kansas City. Last five meetings, Denver scored 9, 16, 16, 3, and 6. That's an average of 10 points a game over a three-year span against Kansas City. KC has covered minus 7, minus 8.5, and, and minus 10 during that span, 4-1. and one. Uh, against the spread versus Denver. So that's Denver with a decent offense against KC. And of course, the Broncos offense down the stretch this year, they have scored 9, 10, 13, and 13 for their last five games. The only exception came against the Lions, the same Lions team that just gave up a 50-burger to Seattle last week. So Broncos offense hasn't worked against KC. It hasn't worked down the stretch this season. No Bridgewater again this week. It's going to be Drew Locke. That's a problem. The other side of the football may be just as bad. That's a quarterback nightmare for Denver this week. Ronald Darby's out. Pat Sertain is out. Kareem Jackson is out. They have a COVID outbreak. Their offensive line is decimated. No Jerry Judy. No Bradley Chubb. McManus, the kicker, is on the COVID list right now. This could be Vic Fangio and Pat Shermer's last game. Fangio is the defense, Shermer for the offense. And from all indications, they're not busting ass for either one of those guys, uh, the veterans on Denver. Did I mention the Chiefs are coming off a loss? They had a week 16 loss in 2018. I look specifically at week 16 losses for Kansas City under Andy Reid. Then what do they do in the season finale? Happened three times. They lost in 2018. They won the finale 35 to 3. Happened in 2016. They won the finale 33 to 10. In 2014, they weren't even a playoff team. They lost week 16. They won the finale 19 to 7. Reid doesn't want back to back losses going in. And the Chiefs. Because they're playing on Saturday, we'll go into this game live for the number one seed. Off, you know, and the week off and the bye week, that's a motivator. The Titans haven't played yet. So this line can only go up. I'm surprised we've seen some buyback on Denver this morning. I thought it was only, you know, on a rocket ship to 13 and a half, 14. It's 11 right now. It ain't going much lower. (laughs) Um, Don't wait to get on board for this one. Kansas City. Minus the spot against Denver. There's your big game breakdown. Back to you, Mr. Pratt.